What I'm prepared to argue with anyone in the country. This is the most beautiful constituency. This is the best constituency. I am a very privileged man to be able to stand for this election and all being well to be elected as the Member of Parliament for tonight. A long time since you've had this seat. Yeah. And when you yeah. Lives on this, the second leg of my 36 hour final tour for this election, for some good reasons. And the first one is this man, Derek Thomas, would make an excellent member of Parliament. Yeah. There's another reason for being here, which is this is one of the 23 seats that we need to win as Conservatives to give our country the strong, decisive and accountable government that we need here in the United Kingdom. Yeah, we can do it and we can do it here in St. Ives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Be clear about the consequences of an Ed Miliband SNP government. It would bring our economy to a juddering halt and that would see higher unemployment. You don't have to think too long about what it would mean, because every day we hear from Nicola Sturgeon and the SNP what they want to do. They want to hold the government to ransom, so please get out onto those doorsteps and convince people. If you want to be certain of the government you get, if you prefer me as your Prime Minister, you've got to get out and vote Conservative in St. Ives, in the West Country, right across our country. That's what we want to do. One big argument for the future of our country, it's all about the economy. <laughs> Never let them forget what they left. That's the vote. I'm afraid there is no money. And so when Labour say, you haven't created enough jobs, you haven't seen living standards rise fast enough, we want even more money spent in schools and hospitals, remind them of this note and the mess that they left. <laughs> 